Hi, my name is Marin, and today I have a breathing exercise for you that will help for depression and anxiety. Depression and anxiety is very common nowadays, and I think a lot of us don't really realize that we don't take the time to breathe. Oftentimes when we're stressed or anxious or overwhelmed, we hold our breath or we don't breathe in deeply and we cause ourselves to slowly hyperventilate. When we do this, we don't allow enough oxygen into our system, so it further stresses the system. And also you're not getting the deep benefits of good breathing. And those benefits are increasing your lung capacity and the ease of your breath, as well as expanding all these areas, these air chambers in our body that help stretch and massage our internal organs and spine. So deep breathing is an important practice to get used to. Um, if you're not sure whether you know how to deep breathe or not, you can do a simple practice by placing your hand on your belly and your hand on your chest. It's often good to do this laying down. So if you wanna do this with me, breathe in deep through your nose, exhale through the mouth, and ask yourself which you felt rise, your chest or your belly. If you felt your hand on your belly expand out, that's deep breathing. But if you felt your hand on your chest expand out, then you are shallow breathing and not getting the full benefits of deep breathing. So again, try that exercise while you're laying down and let's go ahead and sit up and talk about this breathing routine for depression and anxiety. Let's start in the easy pose simply by crossing our legs here. You can do this in an upright chair or anywhere you feel comfortable sitting upright. You wanna roll those shoulders back and down, keeping them nice and relaxed. Tuck your chin slightly, elongate that neck in the back. So we're sitting nice and straight, we're in alignment. And we can go ahead and place our hands, palms up, right on top of our knees, and rest your forefinger against your thumb if you feel inclined. From here, we're going to inhale eight times, but we're gonna inhale in puffs. So it's gonna be something like this. Okay, so we're taking small little sniffs into eight puffs. When we fill up our lungs with those eight puffs, we're gonna hold for four counts, and after four counts, exhale for six. So it's gonna look a little something like this. So it doesn't have to be perfect, try it. You're gonna notice that it might be tough to inhale completely at eight counts at first. If that's the case, recalibrate your inhalations to take in smaller amounts of air or just stop once your lungs are full. Hold it for the four seconds and then release slowly out through your mouth for six. Let's do it together this time. Ready? Here we go. Hold for four and exhale for six. Really focus on expanding those lungs and expanding the belly. Let the air into your belly. And you just do this by loosening up the belly and try to make it round and sort of pop belly-ish. That's what we're going for here. As you hold for four, try not to shrug your shoulders up. Try to keep them relaxed and down and just hold by expanding your lung chamber. And then exhale by relaxing and releasing gently and slowly through the mouth. Let's try it again. Again. Let's do it again. So you might be able to tell as you do this, you start to naturally close your eyes. You start to drift off into feeling your breath and focusing on what's going on. And I don't know about you, but in just those three rounds, I feel pretty awesome right now. So let's go ahead and do three more rounds together. Really focus on what you're doing. Try to sit upright, but relax those shoulders. Just focus on that breath. Let's do three more together. Here we go.
So you can carry on with this breathing routine as long as you feel like feels good. If you take just a moment every single day when you first wake up, when you feel stressed, when you feel anxious or depressed, before you go to bed, any of those times to just do five or six rounds, it can be as simple as that. You'll notice your breathing improve. You'll notice you'll be able to relax a little bit more and it will help you automatically gain the benefits of deep belly breathing. So when you're done with this, go ahead and take the time to roll your shoulders out. Let's go ahead and roll them out because sometimes it's easy for them to lock up holding the breath at the top. Just roll them back side to side. If you feel like it, you can tilt your head gently. And you can feel free to sit in this upright pose or lay down in corpse pose and just find some relaxation time for yourself. If you feel inclined, that's great. All we're trying to do here is help the system learn to automatically relax. So focus on this breathing routine and thank you so much for joining me here. I hope you enjoyed this video and I can't wait for you to enjoy the benefits of it. Namaste.